attacking the back. So we've got all of our here. Standard control, my hooks, and my seat belt. All right. So we're going to look at three situations. When I'm neutral, when I'm to the underhook side, and when I'm to the overhook side. So first we're neutral. I'm going back, and I was like taking my hook out and transitioning to what uh, we call Camarillo control. Okay, uh, bridging. So we're here, and I'm just gonna grab this pinky, pulling down, and going through my choke. What Oliver's gonna do is, what everyone does, he's pulling the arm this way. So as he pulls, I lift my leg and catch. Now at this point, my foot goes behind his back, like I'm handcuffing him, arm under the chin, lock onto his scapula, drive my shoulder in, covering the wrist with my chin, and I strangle him one-handed. Let's look at that one more time. I have him just in traditional control. I drive back, take his one hand out here. He strips, I hook, and I choke. We call this the BJ pen. He'd done this in a lot of his fights, and he was pretty famous for it. Next thing is we're gonna say that Oliver drives into me and I'm on my right arm on my underhook, my uh, overhook side. I'm gonna stay nice and tight to him. He's gonna be holding baseball back control. To break this grip, I go wrist to wrist, cut down with my arm, bolt cutter, boom. Hook my own leg, pull my foot behind his back. And I wanna make sure that I don't take my hand out until my foot comes all the way towards the ground. Now I can take my hand out, it's two against one. He's defending strong, I hook his hand, peel it off, come in deep, grab my bicep for the Mata Leon. Let's look at that again. Mission control trap, my coach Javier Vasquez calls this. I shoot to the side. It's called mission control because it's kind of similar to a rubber guard position. Break the grip, hook my own foot, pull it behind his back. Come out, strip the hand, rear naked choke. Mission control trap. Now, what all the kids are doing these days, head to the side, falling to the underhook side. Right. He's going to be defending. What I'm going to do, pull away, hand off. Cross grip control. Once I have my cross grip, I open, hook at the elbow, speed bag, trap, underneath the chin, and now just pull my wrist back, and I get him. Standard control. Take my hook out. Camarillo control. Retract. Punch down and hand off. Now I have the cross grip. When I cross grip, make sure the arms are parallel to each other. I don't want to mix them up. Hook, hand off, lift that chin, and choke. So let's run through all of them again. Starting just by standard seat belt. He's driving back. All right. Grab the hand, put it down. Go to choke. He pulls away hard. Let him strip it and choke. Now we're falling to the overhook side. Take my hook out of embryo control. He's holding tight. Wrist to wrist to break the grip. Hook the foot. Pull the foot behind. Retract my hand. Find the pinky, peel it. Grab my bicep. Now we're falling to the underhook side. Retracting, punching back in to get into my cross grip, straight jacket time. Hook over, foot behind the back, speed bag motion here, lift the chin, one hand to rear naked, making sure I cover the wrist with my chin. So if he goes to grab, go fight, yeah, he doesn't get a good grip, and I can strike him. Reach out and choke somebody, Technique Tuesday. <laughs>